What's up guys? Uh, this is a follow-up video to uh, my previous video on my thoughts of Pacquiao, Timothy Bradley. In my opinion, uh, I think Manny Pacquiao is ready to lose this year. Uh, in recent news, Pacquiao has uh, been on the record as considering retirement after Timothy Bradley. Oddly enough, it's for some kind of a, a Bible study uh, where he wants to go into politics and devote his life to Catholicism. Something along those lines. Um, a point that goes along with that is, uh, is Bob Arum. His, in a way, it's, you know, he plays the puppet master. He's been doing it for, as, you know, I'm sure... <laughs> for many many years and Pacquiao is just another one of these guys who just happens to be you know uh, the head puppet of, uh, of top rank and what it really comes down to is uh, what Bob Arum's job is to do is to build up fighters he builds them up he builds them up he builds them up but at some point when that fighter starts to deteriorate uh, that fighter needs to pass the torch. That fighter needs to take a loss. And he needs to take a loss before he retires. He can't. He can't take a loss. He can't. You know that the fighter who gets built up and built up and built up and turns into a hype job, he cannot retire without losing, or else he doesn't pass on that torch. He doesn't pass on that fame to an, another young up and comer. He needs to. He needs to to make the passing of the of that torch in order to keep Bob Arum's pockets lined. In order to to at least give him, you know, pass on some of the the recognition that he'll always have to another fighter. So Bob Arum has another star uh, in play. And that's exactly what I see happening uh, against Timothy Bradley. It's very difficult to see Pacquiao beating Timothy Bradley technically, uh, but maybe in volume of punches. I I don't even see. T I don't. I I think Timothy Bradley has the style to limit Pacquiao's output because he's just going to be on the inside. See, this is what I love about Bradley because he can fight him on the inside and the outside. He he can do it both ways. He can counterpunch and he can and he can rough him up. It's uh, this is a very good style matchup for Timothy Bradley. And uh, you know, yeah, if he if he does his job and, and works hard enough, he's gonna make Pacquiao look fucking easy, straight up. Uh, and I think Bob Arum is ready. He's ready to give Pacquiao his loss because it seems like uh, he's deteriorating. It seems like he's on the slide, it, and it seems like he's considering retirement. You know, the fight, it's been too long with Floyd Mayweather. The fight has been negotiated for over two years, and and whether it's Pacquiao or Aram, both of them did not want that fight, and they still don't want it. Even if Pacquiao takes a loss, I don't know if he still wants it. Uh, you know, the third, uh, fourth fight with Juan Manuel, Mar Juan Manuel Marquez, no one wants to see that. We've seen it. Uh, Marquez seems to be the better boxer, but has never gotten the official W. And uh, and really, are there any more opponents out there for Pacquiao if if he wins? If he beats Bradley, are there any more opponents out there? The the answer is no. <laughs> the only other guy is Floyd Mayweather, and we all see, you know, they don't want any piece of Floyd Mayweather. So what it comes down to is simple. Pacquiao is ready to lose, and he's ready to lose on June 9th. Uh, I, I, I don't, you see, uh, it seems like the question with this fight is, is the fix in? And my answer is no, I don't think the fix is in. I think Bob Arum is going to play it fair. He's not going to throw in the corruption. I think he's going to let Timothy Brad. he's going to let it be a fair fight. Uh, plain and simple. I think uh, he's gonna let the cards fall where they, where they may, and uh, and perhaps a new star will be born 
on June 9th. Uh, I see Timothy Bradley winning the fight, convincingly. And it's just a matter of whether the judges will will see it the same way we all see it. Because sometimes they're just blind as hell, and it's a damn shame that they are. Uh, I, I like Timothy Bradley, and I think Manny Pacquiao's ready to lose. Uh, he's he's absolutely ready to lose. Uh, and it's just a matter of who's going to pass the torch to. It seems like Timothy Bradley's on the way up, and it's obvious. He's a much better fighter. Uh, Alright, that's it. Like, that's what it is, man. Take care.